Assalamualaikum and a very good morning to all peoples of class 2 F4. Okay, thank you for those who join our science Google Meet uh, this morning. And for those who did not uh, join the Google Meet, please watch this video. So our topic for today is plants. The subtopic is the importance of plants. Okay, the importance of plants. We go through our glossaries first. Okay. The first one is plants. P L A N T S plants. Importance. I M P O R T A N C E importance. Habitat. H A B I T A T habitat. Air. A I R air. Oxygen. O X Y G E N oxygen. Food, F O O D food. Medicine, M E D I C I N E medicine. Source, S O U R C E source. Raw material, R A W raw, M A T E R I A L material. Okay, next, wood, W O O D wood. Furniture. F U R N I T U R E furniture, rubber R U B B E R rubber, bamboo B A M B O O bamboo. Okay, next recreational areas. Recreational areas. R E C R E A T I O N A L recreational areas. A R E A S areas. And last one is garden g a r d e n garden look at this picture okay there are humans plants and animals in the picture look at the car here this is so delicious okay here these long beans can be eaten raw. The air here is so fresh. I want to eat too. Humans and animals need plants to stay alive. Why? Now here we go. The importance of plants. Plants are important to humans and animals because they provide number one, habitat. Okay, as you can see here, Okay, there's a habitat for these animals. Okay, what is the meaning of habitat? Habitat is a place where, uh, where animals live. Okay, for example, a monkey lives on a tree. A squirrel lives in a hole. And then birds live in a nest. The nest is on the tree. Okay, number two. Okay, plants provide air to humans and animals. Plants release oxygen that are needed by humans and animals. Plants is to provide food for animals and humans. Okay, as you can see here, the monkey is eating banana and there are also vegetables planted here because all the vegetables are food for humans now importance of plant is it provide medicine for humans and animals as you can see here some of the leaf can be used to treat wound on humans and you can see here the cat also uh, consuming the leaf as it can uh, be used to treat itself. Okay, give other benefits of plants to humans. Okay, we can see uh, around us, we can see wood is from plants and wood is used in building um wooden houses and also in making uh, furniture like 
a table okay as you can see in uh, around you and there are other benefits of plants that uh, I will tell you later Okay, summary of the importance of plants. Okay, number one, plants provide habitat for animals. Number two, provide air or oxygen for humans and animals. Number three, provide foods for animals and humans. Number four, provide medicine for humans and animals. Five, source of raw materials for humans. Okay, these are other benefits of plants too humans okay raw materials raw materials are such as wood rubber bamboo wood is used in building a wooden house and furniture and make a furniture like a uh, teacher tell you just now like sofa table uh, cabinet and other else and then rubber rubber uh, is from rubber trees and it can be used to produce balloons, rubber bands, and erasers that uh, we use in our school. And then uh, the next uh, raw material is bamboo. Bamboo is used in producing uh, baskets and heads. Okay, next number six. Plants also become recreational areas, for example, like national park and garden. Okay, as in Cebu, you can see like uh, Taman Jubilee Bukit Aub is one of recreational park. Okay, you can see trees and other plants there. Okay, for your task today, uh, I want you to write or copy notes in your science notes and exercise books. Okay, this, this notes that uh, we have got through before. And then task two, and then task two, do exercise in your activity book, page 29. Just match and then color. Okay, that's all from teacher. Okay, I hope uh, you understand watching uh, this video. And see you again. Assalamualaikum. Bye.